I had a question, and the question you, was, how much want, did you cut them you by? You want me to answer How question? much did you cut I'm them by? I'm happy to answer the question. It was round two for President Barack Obama and Governor Mitt Romney. Both went head-to-head -head for the second time for Tuesday's national debate. And as far as who won the debate... It came out very good because of Obama. He lost the first debate, and he finally got it together last night and came out strong. And uh, he came true as I expected him to. News 2 on Wednesday asked several people in the community who watched the debate exactly who they felt came out on top. President Obama came out with a game plan because the last time was basically kind of lackadaisical. But now he just came out and he knew what he had to do to, at least to at least produce um, and, and have his game plan on as far as um, what the whole country is involved in, you know, what um, between him and Romney, what his, what his agenda is, so to speak. What you saw that there were times during the debate that Governor Romney found himself running out of steam, so to speak. The sloganism and the bumper sticker type of comments, that may sound cool in campaigning, but it's not a prescription for governing. Obama brought up some points that really made sense. And I know he's going to be a good president for the next four years for America. It's not necessarily, presidency is not basically based off of, off of debates. It's based off of um, what, you, what you have in mind for the country to move forward. And his, his whole thing is, let us, let us move forward. And while opinions will vary on the debate, many Virgin Islanders come together on one issue, the hope that the territory will one day be able to vote for a candidate that's debating. For News 2, I'm Allison Bourne-Vanak.